my channel. So, guess what? I think that it is well overdue and you guys have requested it. Um, it's time for us to jump back into baseball. I know some of you are probably like, back, you've never been into it, but I have. I do have a video um, that is on my channel that I have taken a look at in reference to baseball. So this will not be my first one, but I think um, now that I'm, you know, you guys are requesting it and you guys want it. So I'm like, okay, now I think you guys really, you know, I'm gonna give you guys what you want. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at Barry Bonds in the world of baseball. Definitely is a sport that I know of. So I cannot say I've never heard the name Barry Bonds, but um, I know you guys, some of you guys don't even believe me, but I know I've heard the name Barry Bonds. I know that it has something to do with baseball and that's about it because I like I've stated and some of you guys are new to this you guys are gonna learn the first time like this is what I'm doing here like I stated I wanted to learn more about sports I wanted to become more fluent in the conversation about sports be able to talk the talk when it comes to sports just know what's going on in the world like I can tell you a lot of things about makeup I can tell you a lot of things about hair I can tell you a lot of things about Beyonce and music and any anything like that when it comes to girls um but when it comes to an actual sport which is also something that is very highly popular in the world i cannot converse about much of anything and then i jumped into this and then learned about all kind of other sports that even existed and like every single sport that i've taken a look at is so freaking interesting and so different and so like just intricate i i'm loving what i'm learning but Back to this, Barry Bonds, baseball, I just know the name, don't know what he looks like. So I always take a look at a little bit of information, get a glimpse of who he is and what he looks like, and then take a look at a video. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do. So let's jump right into it. Let's go. All righty. All right. So Barry Bonds, as far as what he looks like, let's go here. So this is who I'm going to be paying attention to as far as who I'm taking a look at. Here goes another one kind of closer on his face. Okay. So with that, we're going to now get a little bit of information. All right. So Barry Lamar Bonds was born July 24th, 1964. He is a former professional baseball left fielder who played 22 seasons in the Major League Baseball with the Pittsburgh Pirates and San Francisco Giants. All right, so he is currently 54 and he was born in Riverside, California. He bats with his left and he threw, well, batted with his left and threw with his right. And he debuted May 30th of 1986 for the Pittsburgh Pirates. And what else do we have? His last um, MLB appearance was September 26, 2007 with the San Francisco Giants. So he went from Pittsburgh to California. Uh, let's see here. His statistics, his batting average is a .298. Um, so I'm still learning. So I'm, there's a lot that I don't really know what is what. So batting average is defined by the number of hits divided by at bats. Um, usually reported in three decimal places, which it is. A player with a batting average of 300 is batting 300. Oh, okay. Okay. So, based thing, he's, well, he's almost batting at 300. He said 298, 298. He's got 762 home runs, uh, 2,935 hits, runs batted in 1,996, and 514 stolen bases. As stated, he's played for the Pirates from 86 to 92, from the, for the Giants from 93 to 2007. His career highlights and awards that we could take a look at. He's got 14. Um, he's 14 times um, as far as being an all-star. He's done that 14 times. NL MVP, um, seven times with that. He's got an eight. He's eight-time Gold Glove Award and 12-time Silver Slugger Award. Three-time NL ha uh, Hank Aaron Award. And then two-time NL batting champion. Two-time NL home run leader. So he's good at a lot of things here. NL RBI leader, I'm not sure what that is. Um, in baseball, run, oh, run batted in. So that's what the RBI is, okay. And then um, they retired number 25 from the San Francisco Giants. And then he is also on the San Francisco Giants Wall of Fame. 
So um, let's see here, MLB Records, I believe we just discussed that up there. So it shouldn't be too different. 73 home runs in a season. What else do we have? Uh, 2,558 career walks, 688 career international walks. And then his medal record, he represented the United States Amateur World Series in 1984. Um, and he got bronze, he got bronze with, uh, with Cuba for the team. So that's just a little bit of information there. I love to kind of get a glimpse of like how, how good he was or what, he's, what he achieved or what he did uh, before I go ahead and take a look at him actually in action. So now let's go ahead and see Mr. Barry Bonds in action. You guys hear that sound like it's the first shot and it sounds like that it sounds like fireworks or like a gunshot or something going off goodness bring the action Imagine being in the crowd trying to catch one of those. Bonds goes on the first pitch. Reed, it's up early, but Bonds oh. How do you even have time to steal a base? Like, you only have such a small window. Like, how in the world do you steal, like, a base? Because, of course, I know a little bit. I know that, that that's called stealing a base. But how in the world do you kind of, like, calculate proper timing like you have to really react quick right on the second man in the history of baseball with 40 homers and 40 steals in one season could actually be higher than that. like so first of all you have to be fast i assume but does he take why is he taking the base i don't even want to ask a dumb question but i don't know is he does he really like and he stole the base does he really take the base because he's taking the base Homers and 40 steals in one season. Could actually be higher than it was last year. That ball is drilled to deep right, and that could be number 400. It is. He's done it. He has become the first man in the history of the game to hit as many as 400 home runs and steal as many as 400 bases. What? 400 home runs, 400 stolen bases, like the first. And that's a lot. I wonder, like, in, in what time frame he did that, too. Like, how long and what time span did he take to achieve that 400 and 400? Goodness. Now it is indeed full. Oh, it's the box. Right field. Headed to the Cubs. Out of here. And this game is time. <laughs> did that just go completely out of the stadium into the water? Twice, hold on, am I tripping? Like he can straight up kill a fly with his bat because he's so freaking accurate and just times and coordinates everything is like perfect and precise. And then the power behind this is crazy. Eric. The big candidate for kill 
strength behind every single hit that he did home run all over the place i know this is a highlight video of course so i'm not going to catch when he probably didn't hit one or when he you know probably didn't hit the ball or whatnot but regardless it does show how strong he was and just how accurate he was hand-eye coordination was crazy and amazing i definitely enjoyed taking a look at him he definitely does an amazing job at when when he played baseball that's for sure but I hope you guys enjoyed taking a look at him as much as I did. If you guys did, make sure you guys give the video a thumbs up. And if you guys have not subscribed, please subscribe and hit the bell so you guys can get alerts for my next baseball video. For all you guys that are all baseball fans out there or any sport whatsoever, just make sure you guys hit the bell. Check down in the description box below so you guys can get my Twitter and Instagram because I want to see you guys all on there. And I'll see you guys next time.